Cinema 5D at CineGear 2017 is brought to you by B&H, the professional source for all your video needs. Schneider, it starts with the glass. Blackmagic Design, amazing solutions for film, post-production, and television. Tilta, arm your camera. And Panasonic, cinematic moments for your production. Hi, I'm Johnny from Cinema 5D, and I'm here with Dwight Lindsay from Lindsay Optic. Hello. Hi. Hello. Um, and you have something new that you created, which is what actually? Uh, it's a macro lens attachment series. We have uh, these macro lenses in the strengths of plus one, plus two, and plus three. Uh, they attach to other lenses like this Zeiss Compact Zoom. Uh, they attach to Zeiss Ultra Prime, Schneider uh, Xenon, Schneider Xenar, Cook 5i. We will attach to uh, Cook S4 and Leica and some other lenses as well. So you really have to define the type of lens in order to uh, put your, um, your macro adapter? Um, uh, yeah, we, uh, here is the lens and then there are some adapters, mechanical adapters that attach it to uh, the, uh, the base lens that you're attaching to. So uh, you do need to know what you want to attach it to so that you can uh, get the right adapter. Macro adapters were uh, existing before. So what is so special about this one? Well, these are uh, three lens elements. They're very, very highly designed and manufactured. And uh, the uh, plus one uh, uh, strength will hold 200 line pairs per millimeter across a full frame 24 by 36 format. Uh, no one else is doing that. The plus two is not quite as good, 130 line pairs. And the plus three, again, not quite as good, something like 100 line pairs across the format. Uh, the Arri Alexa camera, this very fine camera we have it on, has a low-pass filter in it which cuts at 65 line pairs, I'm told by Ari. So in every case, our lens is better than what is required for uh, the Ari Alexa camera. So actually, if I put this adapter on one of the lenses, like let's say the recommended lenses, uh, you demonstrated earlier and it was quite impressive that if I focus on a certain object and then pull zoom, the focus will stay the same. Yes. How do you achieve this? Uh, by good design. Uh, it's uh, designed uh, to do that and uh, uh, that's all. It's designed to do that. <laughs> and would you recommend putting this uh, macro adapter on zoom lenses or fixed focal length lenses? It works on both as long as the diameter is uh, reasonable. If the diameter of the lens is something in the 90 to 110 millimeter range, then it works fine. And if it's a, a zoom lens, up to what focal length uh, it will hold nice? Uh, until now, the only zoom lens we've had it on is this uh, 70 to uh, 200. We've had it on prime lenses as short as 35. So um, I, I guess in the range of 35 millimeters to uh, 200 millimeters. Uh, it may do a little more, but we haven't tested that yet. How about price and availability? 2,100 uh, for the lens. The adapters are uh, $98 each. Uh, the availability, uh, let's say, 1st of August 2017. Right, thank you very much, and thank you very much for watching.